Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Freddy Santiago. Today I will be creating a look that is requested by one of my clients turned friend. I normally do her makeup for her New Year's party but this year she decided to greet the New Year on the other side of the Atlantic. She, like me and many others, bought the Lizzie Eldridge Cinnabar palette and she asked me to create a party look that would go well with her rose gold sequin outfit. So yeah, it's another party look coming your way. So without further ado, let's get started. Beginning with skincare, I will use this eye cream from Bobbi Brown. followed by this face cream from Bobbi Brown as well. For lips, I will use this tinted lip balm. And to finish this skin prep, I will use this Beauty Elixir from Claudely. And we're good to go. And on the skin, I will use the Lisa Eldridge Seamless Skin Foundation. For corrector, I will be using this one from Charlotte Tilbury. For concealer, I will be using this one from Charlotte Tilbury as well.
To add a bit of illumination, I will use this elevated glow from this Eldridge. For contouring, I will be using this Face Contour Stick from Burberry. Now onto eyes, I will begin by using this Eye Paint Duo from Strokes, but I will only be using the matte side, and I will use that as a base. And then onto eyeshadow, I will begin with this color here. And then using this rose gold color here. And then going in with a dark brown eyeliner, I'm going to create a flick that would also help to decide the shape of that eyeshadow.
and then using a pointy brush i'm going to smudge that And then using a finer flat brush, I'm going to use this color, the darkest in the palette. And then using a floppy brush, I will be going in with this color here now. And I will now map the shape of the eyes. Then going in again with this flat brush, I will be reapplying this color just to intensify it even more. And then using a synthetic brush, I will be going with this color here, which is the last color in the palette that I haven't used. And I'm just going to press that on the very center. Going back with this pencil, I'm going to rim that on my lower lash line, mainly on the outer corner. And then using this pencil brush again, I'm going to smudge that. And then using this reddish brown in here, it's going to smudge that even more, but also to set it. There you go. On the lashes, I will begin with eyelash curler first. And then mascara.
And then using this tight lining brush, I'm going in with this darkest color here. And I'm just going to put that flick on flick. Right, so that's my lashes done and I've also popped in a pair of my trusty Divisoria lashes. Now on the brows, I will begin with this brow pencil first from Surat. And I'm going to set that with this brow pomade from Surat as well. Going back to skin, I am mixing a tiny bit of that Elevated Glow and the Velvet Cinnabar lipstick and I'm going to use that as a blush. For powder, I will be using these two powders from Charlotte Tilbury. One is number one fair and number two is medium. The fair will go on the center and underneath my eyes and then the medium all over my face. For bronzer, I will be using this one from Galan. And on the lips, I will begin with the Cinnabar Lip Pencil first.
and I'm going to finish this lips this time with this Cinnabar Gloss Embrace. And there you have it, a really glam way to help you greet the new year with renewed hope and renewed zest for life. 2022 has been very challenging for most of us, if not all of us, and I just want to salute each and every one of you for continuing to weather life and continuing to smile through all the adversaries that life has thrown your way. I'm not sure if I'll be able to come up with another video before New Year, but just in case I wasn't, I want to wish all of you a very happy New Year. Thank you for going on this journey with me. I look forward to continuing it and I hope you will still be with me and see you next year. Bye!